NVIDIA I.O. versus the new player on the block, and that is Syllabi I.O. I say new player, it's been around a few years, but we're not going to mess around. We are going to dive straight into this video. If you want to test any of these softwares out, I'll link them down below for you. They offer a seven-day free trial. So this is NVIDIA, been around for a number of years. This is the interface on the inside. This is Syllabi. Now, if you was going on first impressions, for me personally, I like this one. A lot more cleaner, a lot more slicker. However, that doesn't mean it's better. We're going to test it, okay? So, to create a video on both of them, really straightforward and simple, on Syllabi, we come over here and we click on Faceless Video, because that's what we're going to do. We're going to create a faceless video. Over on NVIDIA, same concept, we're going to click on Create an AI Video. Then over here, you've got a few options. What sort of video do you want to use? Now, for this, to make this a like-for-like -like comparison, I'm just going to put in a script and I'll show you the script I've got. I've just had Grok this. You can see Superman versus Red Hulk, 40 seconds. So I'm going to copy that. I'm going to put that over here into NVIDIA. So I'm going to click on Use Script. I want a YouTube. Yeah, we'll go with, in fact, we'll go with TikTok. We want to create a video for TikTok using exactly this script. I'm going to paste that into there. Now, the other thing I'm going to do is we're using the basic plan on both of these okay so the basic plan on nvidia and the basic plan on syllabi the, the cost is i think it's about one or two dollars difference but very similar so here we've got another option now settings so on the basic we can only use stock media generative down here our generated images costs more money whereas over on syllabi it's all generated images which is awesome then we can choose a background music. You can obviously change your language. You've got subtitles. So if you want subtitles on here, you click on here and you can go through and add some. So let's just go with add clean subtitles with a popping effect. Can't change the color or anything on that. Do we want a watermark, music, etc.? No. So for now, I'm just going to click on continue. And then I'm going to click on generate video. Now, this is the thing with NVIDIA. It will go ahead now and it will analyze the script. And then what it does is it uses stock footage. So it will go across all of its partners and find related images for that script and create a video. OK, so whilst that's going away and doing that, we're now going to go over to syllabi and do the same process. It's a little bit different. So I want to create a video. OK, now the first difference between the pair of these is this one here has templates and i'll show you this now so if i click on view all we have now got all of these different templates that, that we can use with this so for example if i wanted to create a video with a comic book theme i'm not i can't do that it wouldn't be fair because in video doesn't offer that so we want something similar so for this we will go with hyper realism okay we'll go with that one and we'll click on continue then we scroll down, straightforward and simple, English, do we want subtitles? So this over here is your subtitles, it goes over here, you can change them, and you can see exactly how they look. Then you've got voices, so someone who's going to read the script, and then video length, and obviously, because we're doing TikTok, we're doing a TikTok video, we want this one over here, okay? And you can change your subtitles and other effects, okay? So that's that bit done. Then we want our script. Now, again, in here, you can get syllabi to do the script for you. You can do audio to video, but we're just going to paste it into here like so. So there is our script. Let me move my head and I'm going to click on generate video. Now, when I click on generate video, this pops up over on syllabi. It gives you other ideas for you know, other videos related to the one you've just put in. If I come back over to NVIDIA. Oh, here we go. We're nearly done. So who is this for? So look, and you can see this is for comic vans, rapid cuts, platform. We'll go with that, okay? Click on continue. Then it's going to create the video for us. So let's go back over here to syllabi. Let me close that. And then you can see now that's gone down here into my video. So that's rendering. And this one's on 11, 12%. So I'll pause the video and I'll come back once it's done. And we'll have a look at the difference between the two videos. Okay, we're back very quickly. Here's the thing. Syllabi has already created the video. It's all done. Good to go. If I come over here to NVIDIA, you can see it's still loading. So that's one thing that I found. Syllabi is a lot quicker than NVIDIA. Okay, so again, I'll pause it. I'll come back once I've both done. Okay, so we're done. Now, let me show you the NVIDIA one. 
So on the NVO one, this is how it looks, okay? So hopefully it turned up, let's go. Earth shakes as Superman meets Red Hulk, steel versus rage in a desert showdown. Clark soars in, fist blazing, Red Hulk roars, heat melting sand to glass. A punch lands, boom, Superman staggers but grabs Ross, hurling him skyward. Red Hulk crashes back, fists glowing, slamming Clark into a dune. As you can see, it's incredibly fast and also the images are terrible. <laughs> They're absolutely terrible. Now you can edit this. So if you click on edit here, these are the images for the actual video and you can see where NVIDIA is pulling it from. So you can see it's getting this one from this image of video from Storyblocks. We've got this one from iStock and this is it. So you can go through and edit it. If you're not happy with any of the images and things, you can do it, okay? So you can edit it down there. Straightforward and simple. You can also change your music, your script and other bits on here, okay? But that's the video. Let me show you syllabi. So same concept in syllabi, you can change individual Im images straight off the bat. You can see if we we'll go back over here, let's go to media. If you look at the images there versus the images here, night and day and uh, <laughs> syllabi is far better. Let's look at the actual video. Steel versus rage in a desert showdown. Clark soars in, fists blazing. Red Hulk roars, heat melting sand to glass. A punch lands, boom! Superman staggers but grabs Ross. So as you can see, that is the output of the video. A hell of a lot better over on NVIDIA without a doubt. So if we come back over here, so we can change our images here over in NVIDIA. Okay, so you can change them. You can even upload your own videos. So you just simply come in here, you can upload it. You can change the stock media here. So look, replace media. So you can click on there and then you can search for Basically, you can search for any image that you want or any video, and it will go down here. And you can find them. Over in Syllabi, if you wanted to change any of these images, you'd scroll along to the one which you want to change. Let's just go with this one, for example. So if I click on Edit Image, here I can add motion to it. I can upload it, or I can just click on Image Regeneration. And you can see here, look, you can regenerate it based upon the prompt that you put over here. And that's it. So once you're happy with that, you click on save and that is it done. So at this moment in time, I think we can agree it is without doubt one nil to syllabi. It really is. If I come back over here into NVIDIA, let's come out of the actual video and let's look at some I mean look at that image. Let's come out of here, let's go home, and let's look at some of the other things that are available inside of NVIDIA. And we'll also go over to syllabi and we will have a look at some of the things that are available in syllabi so let's start with in video we have got media library generative picks voices text to clip text to image basically it's everything to do with the image in the video that you're creating okay which is great you can change it all in there if we come over to syllabi you will notice we have got a lot more options in here so if we had created our video we wanted to create a thumbnail over with in video over here we could potentially do text to image we could create an image in fact we'll do it so describe a scene and then we'll do one over here as well we'll do the same so thumbnail generator i'm going to click on that and it says here look tell us about your video so i'm just going to type in something very basic i'm going to type in superman and again we'll put it into both i type in superman oh i can't even spell superman versus red hulk in the desert okay so I'm going to copy that, like so, click on create thumbnail, that'll create three for me. So I'll come back over here and I'm going to click on paste and I'm going to click on generate an image. Now, here's the thing, with NVIDIA, you can see here on the basic plan, it wants to charge me for this. If I want it to do, it says generative, that will cost me $120 a month. On syllabi, it's included in there. Or, or on NVIDIA, you can do it as a one time for $10. I'm not paying $10 for one image, okay? So let's come out of here. Let's go over here. And as we can see on here, look, we've already got it. So in syllabi, we have got Titans Clash. We've got this one and this one. So we've got three different images that we can use. And if I click on here, I can have a look at it and make it bigger. And again, if you don't like it, you can have it do more videos, okay? So that is literally it. So that is the difference between those two down there. And then if we come back over here and let's go back into syllabi. Let's come out with the thumbnail generator. There's a video editor in here. Now, there's one thing what literally stands between the pair of them, and that is this over here. 
So on here, on Syllabi, you can connect your social media accounts and you can schedule out your content across Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, etc. NVIDIA, again, doesn't offer that. Not even on the premium plans, it doesn't offer that over there. And then we can also check your analytics in Syllabi. You've got bulk scheduler. The other thing, and again, <laughs> the other thing on here is you've got discover ideas. So in Syllabi, you can sit here, here, explore trending topics across social media platforms. And you can type it in here using YouTube, Google Trends, etc. Don't have that option over here in NVIDIA. But if we're looking at it from the standpoint of it just being an AI video platform, I think we can agree. Syllabi wins, hands down. It does. And I'm going to show you this as well really quickly. If I come over here, you remember at the beginning of the video, when I said to you it offers templates, let me show you this. So when I click on view all, so it will create a video for us based around these templates. So we'll stay with the superhero theme. So if we wanted to go with a theme of a comic book, we'd select that template there. And then it's going to create a full video for us in this style over here. Okay, so I'm going to click on there, click on confirm. You can see it's gone over here. Now I'm going to put in a script. So let, let's grab a script really quickly and we'll say to Grok, please give me, give me, oh, sorry, please give me a 40 second video script for, let's just go with, I don't know, let's go Superman again, Superman versus Deadpool. Let's do that one. And all I'm doing here is, and, and this is normally the process that I'm doing myself anyway, is I'm going over to Grok, I'm getting a script, and then I'm just pasting that script over into Syllabi, okay? So we'll do this, we'll pause the video, I won't make you wait around for that, I'm going to do that, I'm going to come over here to Syllabi, I'm going to paste that into here, we're using that template, I'm going to click on Generate. And then again, we get suggested ideas coming down here, but let's get rid of that let's pause the video and i'll come back and i'll show you once we've got our comic book one okay we're back the video is done let me show you it briefly but you can see straight away we have gone with the comic book theme let's put this over here let's press on play let's have a look at it see if it's any good metropolis meets madness superman faces deadpool steel against sass clark flies in stern and steady wade pops up katana's flashing hey big blue a punch sends Deadpool flying oh. crash through a wall. But he so as you can see, it's absolutely awesome. I love the fact with Syllabi, it offers these different templates as well. So look, that is today's video. That is Syllabi IO versus NVIDIA IO. If you want to test them out, the link's down below. I would highly recommend you go with Syllabi because as you can see, the difference is night and day. And a side note, if you go and check out Syllabi, I'll put a link below. I'll send you over my four day free little course, which will show you how to set up a YouTube channel, make money, and all the other good bits. So, look, that is it. Any questions, let me know. What do you, I mean, what do you think? What's the, do you use either of these? Do you prefer either one of them? Let me know. All right. I'll see you soon.